If you guys like this video, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. Check out my channel, I post a new video every day at night. Jumping right into this. Oh, if you guys want me to review your match, hit me up on Instagram, send me like, send me a video of like a minute long that you want me to review, cause like until I get my live set up, I, I won't be able to do a whole, bit, like, like to review a whole three minute match will take me so long. Usually just one or two exchanges is the most I can do and still post a nine. Just hit me up on Instagram, Isaac Gomez with four Z's, but jumping right into this, okay? So growing up, I, I knew a man's height is like one of the defining characteristics he has with the opposite sex, all right? So of course, when you hear rumors like this, you're gonna be extremely, extremely cautious. And it could cause some of you guys to quit wrestling altogether. And I'm here to tell you as someone that's 6'1", and I, all right, so what will stunt your growth is malnutrition. Not eating the right food, not eating enough of the right food, not, you know what I mean, not exercising, allowing yourself to atrophy, you know what I mean? Wrestling is like, there's certain aspects of the sport where you, some people have feel they have to cut weight, but you never have to do anything to wrestle. You know what I mean? You can just wrestle your weight. You can just go to practice. You know what I mean? You can just like try your best. Like, like you do not have to cut weight. Cutting weight is what will stunt your growth. All right, do not quit because you do not have to. You, like, you do not have to cut weight. And I, I feel like in high school wrestling, cutting weight is kind of like it's like, eh. Nah, motherfuckers are cutting weight. What am I saying? What am I saying? Motherfuckers are cutting weight every day. And until something is done soon, nothing will change. You know what I mean? Motherfuckers are cutting weight. I, I shouldn't lie to myself. I shouldn't lie to you guys. If you don't want to stunt your growth, you know what I mean? In your developing years, obviously, bef for boys, but before you're like 25, you're growing. You like, you still have like room to grow. Your feet will grow. Your hands will grow. Like, like you will grow still. I'm telling you exercise and hard work is not what stunts growth. What stunts growth is malnutrition, okay? So wrestling will not stunt your growth. People use examples like Henry Cejudo and like, I, like I can't name another short wrestler off the top of my head, but people use short wrestlers as examples of like, look, it stunts your growth. L look at Henry Cejudo, like, obviously it stunts your growth. I'm telling you, that is just such a bull-faced lie. That is such a, like, that is such just like a blatant lie. Because the reason, like the reason why you see so many short wrestlers that are good is because in very, very few other sports can they like, like wrestling is the absolute truth for humans, all right? It is the absolute truth. There is no, wrestling is the worst insult anyone can tell you, the most truth, the most like, you are just like your fault, like, you know what I mean? It's, it's just the worst shit anybody can tell you on a mat, you know what I mean? Because like, any mistake you make gets, you know, it, it gets picked on and cracked open and digged and you, like, people try to take advantage of it. People try to use you, like people try to trick you into it. You know what I mean? Wrestling is the absolute truth. It is how smart you are, how fast you are, how, like how dominant you are as a wrestler. Okay. And that's why like, like th there aren't any advantages you can have, like in basketball, some people are just born seven foot two and they can just grab the rim standing up. You know what I mean? Like, like that's an advantage you have. You're closer to the rim, all right? Maybe you have other advantages where you have like weak knees or ligaments or whatever, but not my point, all right? Some people have faster cars. Some people have like lighter skateboards. Some people have like better wheels. I don't know. You know what I mean? But like in wrestling, there is none of that. You're, I'm here to tell you, I've never done a shoe review because shoes do not change the way you wrestle at all. Not even a little bit. Not even a little bit. I am telling you as someone, like I have, I have worn shoes two sizes too small into a match because mine had a hole in them. You know what I mean? Like I, it doesn't change anything. It really doesn't change anything. It, what matters is up here. What matters is up here. What matters is the hard work that you've put in to get onto the mat, okay? No amount of wrestling is gonna stunt your growth. What will stunt your growth is not eating enough, cutting too much weight, being too, being too sacrificial in your training. And I'm guilty of this. You can watch some of my, some of my live workouts. I'm literally sprawling on like, my stone because I feel like it'll make my shins better. And I walk around and my knees hurt, all right? 
Like, just take everything with a grain of salt. Obviously, mentally, it will make you tougher. Like, mentally, all those difficult and like, all that shit I put myself through, at the end of the day, made myself mentally stronger. But like, it does wear on your body. You are literally sacrificing your body for your mental strength, all right? You don't wanna sacrifice your body so much that you cut three weight classes, you know what I mean? I was cutting, my senior year, I was cutting clearly 15 to 17 pounds every single week. Clearly 15 to 17 pounds every single week. And I was not, I was not like, I was not eating for multiple days at a time. For multiple days at a time. Or if I did eat, I would have like sip of water after practice and I would have like a couple grapes at lunch or, you know what I mean? Like I would really, 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 really push the limits. Like nobody should, like, Nobody should do that and I'm here like I made this channel to help people not fall into the traps that I did All right, just don't quit wrestling keep on practicing keep on wrestling. I'm telling you even outside of wrestling What wrestling does is like I became a really really Decent fabricator. Here's some of my work. I, I Have like five project cars. I work on all of them. I you know what I mean? I've done 99% of all the work to all of them. I like, I, I'm a pretty decent painter. I, like, I started rapping randomly. I, you know what I mean? Like, I, I, I have this ability to work extremely hard at things because I train myself to do it with wrestling. All right, and you can do it too. Literally anybody can get this ability. Anybody can become good at anything if you just like wrestle, bro, just wrestle. And then the rest will just fall into place. I'm telling you. If you guys like this video, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. I post a new video every day at nine. But until next time, I'll see you guys.